Well, 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 it's time to start. Let's see who's gonna connect. Let's see, Stephanie, good evening, how are you? Good evening, teacher. I'm fine. <laughs> I'm here in my house. <laughs> how was your day? I'm um, very good because today was my free day, so I just stay here in my house and I was just doing some emails because I for, forget to do it yesterday and I ate some fruit around 10 minutes. 10 minutes or I said 10 minutes. 10 minutes ago. Oh, 10 minutes ago and most likely I just stay in my bed. That's cool. Yeah, because it was my free day, but tomorrow I, I go to my job. So tomorrow you gotta go work. Yes, because I have this the split day, so I just work on, I, I just work on Monday, Tuesday, and then I have free day, and then I have to go on Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And then I rest on Sunday. Okay, that's nice. Yeah. Interesting. So, what did you do today? As it was your day off, tell me. Yeah, so I woke up around, um, let me see, around 10 a.m. Then I made, I made my breakfast and I gave some to my father because he was hungry, was angry, and then I just... Hungry, hungry. Un he was hungry, and then I just go to my bed again, and I start playing some video games on my phone, and it was Wild Rift, it's LOL, I don't know if you know about that, but I start playing mm, really? and on my cell phone, and then I... I just playing around two hours, I think. I then I eat at noon eight. and eight at noon, and then I just start to write some emails because I forgot to do it because we have a webinar from tomorrow, so I have to send this email from all the franchisees that we have and then i just go to take a shower to take a shower and then i came again to my bedroom <laughs> and start playing but and just waiting to start the the meeting for english class okay that's nice quite interesting yeah so you made a today lot of activities today I think it most likely kind of playing I, is my rest day. <laughs> okay, cool. Excellent. Thanks for sharing and welcome to the class. Thank you. Let's see, Jose Wilfredo. Hello, how are you? Hello, teacher. Uh, thanks to God. Everything good, teacher. What about you? Here, yeah, here, you know. Same old, same old. Yeah, my day was like usual when I have to work. Today is, when's your day off? Today is Wednesday. No, no, uh, yesterday was my day off. And then I have my rest day on Friday. 
But and you got to work I weekend. Work. Yeah, actually, I work weekend. Ouch. Yeah. Sorry to hear that. Uh, sometimes it's really good because you can save a lot of money. You cannot go out yeah. uh, whatever way you want. But at least I go out at 6 p.m. So I have a time to go to to dinner with my family or a friend or do something. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, it's. I mean, it's always good whenever we spend time with the relatives and and as you said, I mean, it's sometimes we we overspend, right? Yeah, yeah. Spend true. too much. Yeah, that's right. That happens to me a lot. <laughs> so we need to save a lot of money. We need to uh, make a good invest to spend when we have to because well yeah the problem is that i am spending right now i am investing actually but in my belly you know <laughs> yeah i know i know that's what you're my talking problem about right now <laughs> no, i'm heavily maybe... investing on my belly <laughs> no that's really good to drink. but yeah. thanks to god everything good so so far, so good. Great, great. Good to know. It's always good to know. Yeah. Thanks for sharing. Thank you very much. No, thank you, teacher. Okay, thank you, teacher. Let's see. Where is, where is, where is uh, uh, Daniel? Is Daniel around? Hello, Daniel. Are you around? Hi, teacher. Hello, Daniel. How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm just great. Just great. Long time to see. Tell me, how's everything? What's it doing? Uh, everything is right, actually. We are working in a project at Metalio. Oh, really? Yeah. And hopefully this week we sign another contract with the city hall oh that's nice yeah I can't yeah that's really nice yeah that, i mean you keep busy and tell me what about december the end of december did you work a lot yeah it was really really hard but uh, finally we end in the project in well the project that we had in uh, Colonia Libertad. Hmm. San Salvador? Yeah. Oh, okay. You could finish the, 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 the project on time. Yeah. Yeah, on time, <laughs> and, well, we end up a little bit uh, more longer than we expect because she... Okay. The, the listen hour, to me, listen to me. It took longer than expected okay it took longer than expected yes yeah because the owner always want some extra uh, extra stuff i don't know yeah yeah that happens that's i mean that's quite normal right yeah yeah and besides that you always get like there's something, I mean, uh, how do you say that? Uh, there, there are some unexpected situations that arise while working on a project, right? Yeah. And th those little details are the ones that actually eat out the, well, no, they don't eat out, they eat up the, the time. Yeah. Yeah, that happens, that happens. Believe me, I understand you completely. So nice to have you here in class, Daniel. Welcome. A pleasure, teacher. Let's see. Hey, Roxana, how are you? Hi, teacher. Good evening. I'm just fine, thank you. And you? Uh, you know, same old, same old here, as usual, trying to keep busy. Oh, there you are. <laughs> yes. Cool. 
Now, you know, my day was kind of good because I went to work in the morning, in the afternoon, I went to the doctor and I got a, a, a leave of sickness, so. Seriously, but it's yeah, not- Yeah, I got two days, huh? No, 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 no. a little thing, but the I got- The weather. <laughs> yeah, I got two days off. Okay. And I hope they are enough because I need to run many things. I mean, to, I need to run some errands and I don't know if time's going to be enough for me. Yeah, I know. Well, in my case, I was working hard. I have a lot of cases in the day. And my co-workers is, was working in another uh, topic, physical uh, activities. So I just um, work alone all day in all cases. And I just finished work at around 5 p.m. And then finish I went- Finish working. Finish at working. Finish at work, working? Finish at yes. work. Finish working around 5 p.m. And then I went to the Plaza Mula because I, need, I needed to cook. I needed, I needed to, to no i needed to take i needed to take some but some picture for for my son's school oh, and really? yeah uh, you know when when the kids are start to um class i don't know yeah uh, I, yeah we I need barely to, remember yeah. that that process yeah, we need to uh, give some documents, some photos, and I don't know, some Stuff. administrative, yeah. So, uh, and then uh, we took uh, the dinner in house. We have and dinner at home. We have, we have dinner at home, and that's it, I'm here. Okay, cool, excellent, excellent. Great, thank you for sharing and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. No problem. Let's see who else is around. I just got uh, five more minutes. Okay, Anna Claudia, hello, how are you? Hello, teacher, good evening. I'm fine, thank you. Thank you for asking. So tell me, how's everything? What's new? Well, um, today I have my third day off during this week because I requested like a kind of permission. My mom, my mom, is tell me how is the correct way to say this? My mom had a surgery or my mom was surgery? Underwent a surgery. Oh, neither. <laughs> okay, my mom <laughs> uh, was under, no, my mom? Underwent. Underwent. Okay, my mom underwent to a surgery or into a underwent, surgery. Underwent surgery. Okay, my mom underwent surgery last weekend, Saturday afternoon. So I was taking care. I was taking care of her during uh, Saturday night. I couldn't sleep nothing because I was uh, uh, watching every hour for some stuff, uh, temperatures. Mm -hmm. I couldn't sleep at all. I couldn't sleep at all. I yeah, was. I mean, that's that's more colloquial. If you say ah, okay. If you say it the other way, it's it's okay. You understand it, but uh, it's the level of English. I mean, ah, okay. You say, okay. Oh, I couldn't sleep at all. I couldn't sleep at all. So, and. I was, I requested a kind of permission in my job. So I'm, this is the third day, but everything is working fine. She is recovering very well. And I still have time for tomorrow. And then Friday, I will be back again uh, working in my regular schedule. But uh, for the rest of the day, it was busy in making, uh, some errands and making some uh, things, uh, some tasks in house related to my mom care, but everything is okay. 
Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Okay. That's just great. I'm and going to write the word. You say underwent surgery. Uh, in present is undergo. Oh, okay. Undergo. Under, like. Ah, uh -huh. uh -huh. oh, okay. Thank you, teacher. Just give me a sec. Well, thank you very much, Anna Claudia. Uh -huh. Okay, Welcome thank you. To the class. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, I still got a few minutes. Let's see, let's see. Ambar, hello, Ambar. <clears throat> hello, teacher, how are you? I'm just fine, what about you? I'm fine, thank you for asking. Okay, tell me, how are sales? Well, um, I could reach my goal, but uh, the last days, was very calm well, and, well very calm than um another days i need to more sales well yeah that happens that happens you know let's hope everything gets better and tell me i hear some problems with your truck yes uh, because uh, i thing have COVID, but actually, it, how do you say no, no me apego tan fuerte? Oh, uh, it hasn't hit me that strong. It has uh, hit me that strong. Oh, that's good. But uh, sometimes I, I feel fever and sometimes no. Or sometimes I feel cough and sometimes no, it's, it's very strange. <laughs> yeah, well, let's hope you get better soon. It's a pleasure to have you here in class, Amber. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, let's see. Erwin. Hello, Erwin. What about you? How are you doing? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How's everything, my friend? Um, everything is very good with uh I'm very happy because uh, today I I took uh, another contract with another uh, with my cable company or internet company and yeah. it, it was a very good business because oh. I, I'm, I am going to pay less for more services that's great how do yeah. you do that <laughs> uh, well they they say that they have some promotion for people that something like retention plans um because i go to clara and say hey i gonna i i i would like to cancel my contract with you and they offer this this plan is better Mm, that's nice. So it's actually great. I was paying uh, two dollars more than uh, my current uh, pay, and I am going to have more services. That's nice. So it's actually I'm, great. So I am very very happy because that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, of course. It's a good day whenever you get more for less. Yeah, and um, about my my sickness, I am I am better. Um, my illness, uh, my illness, illness. I am continue without symptoms, and uh, I feel good. I okay. I am going to return to work this the next Friday. Friday, next. 28th. Oh, um, it's almost time for you to go back. Yes, it's only 14 days. Oh, just 14 days? Well, actually, but I mean, it gave you time to, to go back to, 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 to normal, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, but I am, uh, I, I am, I was in contact. No, yo he estado. I, I have been. I contact. have been. 
I have been in contact with my my company and we have more cases of the virus. Yes. Um, 25% of the people working there is with the virus. Yeah, and particularly, I mean, uh, your area, your area, it's affected a lot. Yeah. And because, I mean, I, you deal with people on a daily basis. And today we have another uh, news about the, the consequences of the virus. Our uh, laboratory said it's the laboratory that works with us uh, taking the tests, the COVID tests for the, the, the workers and for the, for the staff and, and for the, the clients too. Yes, and, and people that require the, the test. And they uh, called the, to, the, to, to my company and they said, we don't have more tests for today because um, the demand is, uh, we have big. a high demand. Huh? It's too big. It's too big, so we don't have more tests to do. Oh my gosh. Um, wow. Yeah, a lot of people is is getting it. Well, let's hope you can come out of it. Cool. Okay. Thank you. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Who else? Who else? Who else is around? Marta. Hello, Marta. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I am tired, teacher. Tired? My, Why? My work. You, my work Janita was, uh, told me. Janita told me. Martha she, does she nothing here. all day long. <laughs> no, teacher. My work, my work was a very, a very hard day um, because I am going to make a... Um, Today in the system uh, of, of the company this weekend. Um, that is a lot of work for me, teacher. But oh, I am ready so for the class. <laughs> that's great. That's great. So as Janira says, you are finally going to work. That's cool. I'm no, kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Help me. She don't help me. She doesn't. Me, she doesn't. She doesn't help me, teacher. Well, let's hope you can do all your stuff on the weekend. Man, it's going to be a lot of work. Marta, welcome to the class. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Hey, guys, let me get the attendance, please. Uh, Amber Eli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Ana Claudia Gonzalez Velasquez. Present, teacher. Uh, Ana Claudia, you stay with me tonight, okay? Ah, okay, okay. Daniel Daniel Eduardo Sagueda Valencia. Erwin Francisco Lopez Rojas. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Thank you, Jose Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. Jose Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present teacher. Thank you, Nicolás. Thank you, Daniel. Eh, Noria Elizabeth López Perlera. I'm here, teacher. Rebeca Yasmin Monterrosa Figueroa. I'm here. Roxana Ibeta Asencio de Mejía. Present. Stephanie Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Oh. Wilman Frank Figueroa Peñate. 
Present. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. Shanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present. Marcela Noemí Batres Monterrosa. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. <clears throat> Thank you. Let's see. Hello, Janina. How are you? Hello, teacher. Hello. I'm good. How are you? I uh, just working. I'm sorry. As I, usual. I was talking mute. Oh my gosh. Come on. Yeah, so how's sorry. everything? Oh, everything is good, teacher. Was a normal day, you know, uh, some cases, um, some calls, and I'm here checking some printer because I have problem. I don't know, maybe some sensor, uh, the paper sensor. I don't know. Really? Remember, there's the hammer. Always the hammer. <laughs> Come on, teacher. This is not a solution. Yes, it is. This is like, a, I don't know who do you say, Cavernicola. Yeah, caveman. The caveman. <laughs> yeah, of course. But it helps. I mean, you get rid of stress at least. Violence is not solution, teacher. Come on, come on. It's not, but it's fun sometimes. Yeah. Uh, is helping to free the stress. <laughs> yeah. Like a hammer. Yeah, you let let off some steam. Yeah. Something, teacher, something. Yeah, well, welcome, Janira. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, I just got time for one more. Let's see who's it gonna be. Uh, hey, Wilfredo, how are you? Hi, teacher. How are you doing? Um, rest, rest and rest all day. Oh, Sleep. really? When do you go back to work? Yes, I... Um, February 8th, I guess. Oh my yeah. gosh. February the 8th. I, it is going to be so so large. Long, so long. Yeah, long, it is. Long. Oh, okay. Yes, but the I uh, so, sometimes I feel so chain because pena. Chain. A chain. 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 Because a shame, a shame. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Give me a second. A shame. A chain. Ah. Yeah, because you just finished your vacation, right? Yes, yes. <laughs> Only work, work uh, two weeks or three. When yes, did you but... come from the States? I'm sorry? When did you come back to El Salvador from the States? Um, I I come back or I, I, I came return. back. I came I came back in 20, 20 December twenty eight. Oh really? Because I only uh, you I, spent I there went. just a few days. Yeah, yes. Because uh, I went, went teacher the, the 18th, right? 20, 22. The 22nd. Yes. Okay. Yes. But um, I went only to, to visit to my father because um, I, I don't yeah. remember if I told you. I remember you told, I remember you telling me the situation. Yeah, I understand you. Yes. Yes. But um, today he, he was. He was, he got uh, his uh, operation. A surgery? A Could surgery. You please, 
Sex. He got a surgery. Sex. Yeah. Yes. Sure. Yes. He got a surgery, and then I, tomorrow maybe he's going to go at home to rest. Uh, I don't know how 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 long. Cuánto tiempo? Yeah, for how long? I don't know for how long. Uh -huh. Yes, I don't know for how long he is going to be at, at home. But then, teacher, I I I, I came back uh, quickly because I. I enjoy it and um, spend this time with my children and my wife. Uh, I, 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 I like to uh, spend together for Christmas yeah. or, 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 or for New Year's Eve. Yeah, I imagine. Well, welcome yes. to the class, Wilfredo. Okay, thank you, teacher. Thanks to you. Okay, guys, first activity, you got two questions. If you look in the Zoom chat, you've got, if you could have lunch with anyone in the world, who would you choose and why? If money was not a problem, where would you like to travel on holiday? Why? Okay, guys, let me just uh, get uh, something for you. Like, oh my gosh, I hate when this happens. Just a second. There you go. I'll send you the question to, the, well, I sent it in the Zoom chat and I also send it to the WhatsApp group. Uh, so you can check it out in any one of them. I'm going to divide you in small groups. You're going to have five minutes to talk about that question, okay? Let me just check on something. Perfect. Okay, groups are created. Please, let's show in five minutes. Hurry up. Or the WhatsApp is is chat the Zoom. I send the question right now. Yeah. Thank you. I can see okay. it. Okay. 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 Well, if you could have lunch with anyone in the world, who will you choose and why? Who would? Who would? Who would? Who would? Who would? Good. Okay, listen, Good. listen, 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 listen. Make the U longer. Wool. Wool. Such a madera? Yeah. Wool. 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 Which is the difference? What is the difference? Wool and wool. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, we need yeah, to we not... need to we need some wool for the fire. Okay, we need some wool for the fire. Would you like to go get it, Roxana? Come. We need some wool for mm -hmm. the fire. Okay, mm -hmm. we need some wool. 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 Listen. wool. We need some wool. wool. Would you like wood? Wood. In this case, in the first one, when it's madera, the U, it's, it's even large. longer. Wool. Uh, wool. Okay. Wool. Would you like wool? In this case, the U is a little bit shorter and the D is soft. Wood. A soft D. Wool. Wool. No wool. But what wool. is the difference when you say wool? Wool, the 
Bien. No, that's good. 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 And good. 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 <laughs> okay. It's I complicated, teacher. It's complicated. <laughs> I try. No. Okay, okay. Uh, how do we do it? Teacher, teacher, I'm sorry. Could you please add me in the WhatsApp group, please? Look, uh, uh, yes, I ask about your case and they are trying to fix it because I cannot add you. They have to do it at the office. Ah. But tomorrow, I expect tomorrow they can solve it for you, okay? But okay. uh, she, she, she can she can use the link or not? He says she couldn't. She couldn't. Or yeah. Yeah. I could I share received a, a, narrow, a narrow message. I don't know why. Yeah, but I mean you need to share it directly to her, to her number, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, perhaps she can give you her number and you can share it to her. Let's try it that way. Just let me get out of this so you can do that, okay? Because remember, everything is recorded here. Looks, yeah, right. Around. Yeah. He, he, have you ever, I know, Alejandra, main Alejandra knows how oh, is Diario de una Pasión, but in English, patient. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I know the notebook. Yeah, that's the notebook, right? Uh, okay, cool. Yeah. And now you understand what I'm talking about. I know yeah. the movie. I know the yeah, movie. Yeah, me too. Yes. Yeah. And it's almost the, the same. Oh well, <laughs> my god. Amazing. Yes, okay. and another another movie on in another book is a uh, when I find when I find you. Oh, okay, perfect. Yes. Uh, that's uh, why you uh, choose uh, you this kind of person, right? <laughs> and the protagonist yep. is Zac Efron. <laughs> when, okay. when, I was, yes, when I was a kid, I, I, well, when I was younger than, than now, I used to enjoy a lot that kind of books, maybe because, because the feelings that they, the yeah. books. Yeah. I know. Okay, <laughs> perfect. Nicholas Spark. Nice. <laughs> nice choose. So, in my case, I nice really pick. don't want to choose uh, uh, like a one person. I, I I would like to choose. I don't know if I can, but I would like to choose a band. <laughs> <laughs> band, a boy band. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Not know, just but... one person. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it, when I was a, when I was a little girl, I don't know if you have ever listened about uh one direction yes yes, yes. but i really really <laughs> fun in very, love with these guys so it's a very famous I, boy band right? yeah yeah i was that kind of girl that always listened the names of the boys like harry Simon, nia Hora, and i was like <laughs> <laughs> i love them and I, I would like to go to their concert, but they are not together right now. But I would like to have, to have a, I don't know, I'm dinner a, with, with this <laughs> <laughs> with a boy band. Blah. Uh, write to you uh, to, to make a trip. Um, so, some options are uh, San Salvador, um, all the typical or or I, I don't know how to say uh, muse museums, museums. Uh, uh, cathedral, palacio nacional, cathedral, 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 and the other option is the our our beaches, and they uh, give the 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 trip to the to El Tunco, to El Sunsal, and El Sonte. So this guy told me that one of the most beautiful things that they, they appreciate in El Salvador is the green, because in all the, the trip, they can see 
many green. They said many trees, many. I have. Uh, Do you um, know Argentina? Uh huh. The 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 boss. Uh, he he from Argentina in holiday. Uh, to in holiday in holiday uh, to travel. Uh, in, I like uh, different, um, I don't know, escritoras. Writers? Mm -hmm. uh, writers, but I very bad to remember the names of the people and series or movies. And <laughs> I like to... A lot of books that different oh. weekends and maybe e I choose that one and ask a lot of questions that when you use your imagination for create the book. <laughs> okay, very interesting. No. Oh my God. Uh, Benitez. I'm sorry, teacher. We were talking in Spanish. Sorry. Yeah, but you said Caballo de Troya, JJ Benitez, right? Excuse me, teacher. Yes. Were you talking about the book? No. No, a movie. Uh, movie. A movie. Which movie? Yes. Troya. Which one? Oh, nice one. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's good Actually, movie. yeah, it's a good movie. Would you believe it that I remember enjoying the book? Ah, okay. I really I like never read the book. It, you never <laughs> read the book? I read the, the I read the original, the, the big one. Oh, okay. okay. It was fun. I was a kid at that time. I was like 13 or 14 years old. <laughs> when I was really, really into the classics. Mm -hmm. So Rebecca, tell me if you could have dinner with uh, anybody or lunch with anyone in the world, who would you choose? Yes, I would like to have that lunch with my favorite band. They are from Italy. And that's it's connected, the, this answer is connected with the second question because I would like to travel to Italy. Okay, so which, I would like to go which there. is the name of the band? Il Bolo. Il Bolo, okay. Yeah. yeah. That's good I would music. like to go there and meet them and also go to the Roman Coalition, I don't know the pronunciation about Coliseum. it. Coliseum. <laughs> Coliseum. Oh yeah, Roman Coliseum. Yes, I would like to, to have the opportunity to meet them and also go to the Coliseum and different places from Italy. Okay. I really love also their, their language. Oh yeah, nice language. Yeah, I think it's easier to learn than English. No. Nope. I think. Not really. You no, think? Really. I'm sure. Because I, I think it's, it's similar to Spanish. Hmm. But I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I, I have well, never yeah. tried. French, French is more difficult. Nah, yeah. French is, is a, it's a special case. I have some friends that are learning that language and they comment about that and they all, yeah. always tell me, I don't know what can I say with my life. <laughs> yeah. Okay, guys, it's time to go back. Mr. Osorio, hello, how are you? Hi, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, teacher. I'm fine. Yeah. Yeah. Today was a busy day as usual, learning something new. 
Okay, that's cool. Welcome to the class. Nice Thank you, teacher. You. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Who's gonna be the first one? Jose Wilfredo. Hello, Telgrin. <clears throat> okay, who are I'm your sorry, teacher, but I have a, a problem with my internet connection. So oh, really? I back until now. Now tell me, if you could have lunch with anyone in the world, who would you choose? Mm, uh, maybe with one highest economistic, because I really want to know um, more about crypto. And maybe we can have a, a good, interesting conversation about it. So you are interested in a, in a, in a business lunch? Yeah, yeah. Okay, interesting. Thank then I, I can have a, a other kind of lunch with other personalities. Okay. That, yeah. Like, like who? I don't know, maybe some uh, personalities about the sports, uh, like soccer, basketball. Oh, okay. I don't know. Yeah. Interesting. Thank you very much. Okay, you're welcome. Let's see, let's see. Maria Alejandra. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? <laughs> I feel like a zombie by Esther here. <laughs> Why? Why do you feel like a zombie? <laughs> I feel very tired because I have a lot of work and my granny, um, I, don't, I don't know if you would say, está enferma, está enferma, was it or sick? Okay, okay, well, I understand your situation, you must be tired, but tell me, if you could have lunch with anyone in the world, who would you choose? I choose um, a writer for a reader or writer, a escritora. A writer, writer. A writer and um, for um, because I like a uh, different book for these writers, but I don't remember the name because. No soy buena en eso. <laughs> um, but I like. That's because, interesting. Uh -huh. But I like because I don't know. Is to ask a different question when read a book and use a, your a, her imagination to write. And I don't know. I think that it's an interesting a conversation. <laughs> okay. Well. Interesting. Thank you very much. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Fernando, hello, Fernando. Hello, teacher, good evening. Good evening, how are you? I'm fine. I'm fine, teacher. Tell me, Fernando, uh, if you could have lunch with anyone in the world, who would you choose and why? I think that I, I would choose my favorite singer. His name is Jose Madero. Uh, okay. Because I, I, I really like his, his songs. Um, I think that uh, it it will be a interesting lunch because he he knows about um, he knows about you know, many many topics. Okay, interesting. Now, if money was no problem, where would you like to travel on a holiday? Uh, my my goal is 
travel Sunday, uh, travel to Norway. Norway, cool. Yeah, its landscapes are beautiful, and I really, I really like uh, go to watching or see the Northern Light teacher. Watch. Watch. Okay. Yeah, I really yeah, like. Yeah, but not on not on winter. Yeah, <laughs> winter. Winter is something pretty special. Okay. It's, okay. it's cool. Yeah, no, it's cold. You're gonna freeze yourself. No, no okay. Okay. I I keep in yes. mind. Yeah, keep it in mind, keep it in mind. Thank you very much. Frank, hello, Frank. How are you? Hi, uh, very well. Fine. Now, Frank, what about you? Tell me, if you could have lunch with anyone in the world, who would you choose? Uh, well, it's a very weird question. But I, I never asked to myself that question before, but <laughs> really? yes, but, but yeah, I, if I had to say something, I would choose some relative, some relative like my mother okay. or, uh, or, or my grandmother. Okay. And now listen, some, up. Some, listen up. Yeah. If I have to name someone. Okay. Okay. If I have to name someone, if I have to name someone, okay. Yes, I yeah. will. I will say my mom. Okay. Yes, okay. Yes, I will say my mom or, or my grandmother. Oh, uh, really? You grab someone? Me. Yeah, someone on, of my family. Uh, I cool. I need cool. more time. I need more time to think. In... Okay. Now, what about? <laughs> If money was no problem, where would you like to travel on holiday? Well, uh, we 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 talk with my partners about it, and I think I will choose uh, some place like Hawaii or something like that. Hawaii, oh, yeah, nice. just for it. Relaxing time, uh, far away from the <laughs> responsibilities, stress of life, and try to feel that kind of life in Hawaii yeah. with the volcanoes, with the with the sea. Yeah, and to experience uh, something different, right? Yes, for try yeah. to something different. Yes. Thank you. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Now let's see, let's see, let's see. Shanira. Yamira. Hey teacher. Hi teacher. Who were who were your partners, Shanira? Uh, my partner was Erwin. Okay, tell me about Erwin. If he could have lunch with anyone in the world, who will he choose? He chose a famous chef. I don't remember the name, but uh, he loved he love cook then. He's a dreamer and his favorite person for take a lunch is uh, this chef. Oh, interesting. That's quite interesting. Thank you very much, Janira. Erwin, tell me about Janira. Okay, Janira said that if money is not a problem, uh, he, she would like to travel around the world. And her... Well, she actually does it quite regularly, you know? <laughs> Come on, teacher. Come on. And her favorite uh, or her principal destination is New Zealand because all the attractive attractions there in, in New Zealand, natural, natural attractions. 
as yeah. forests and maybe a, a sea, sea. The landscapes are beautiful. Yeah, but how do you say mirar los animales? See, see the, to see the animals. See the animals and the landscape too. Mm. Okay, well, interesting. Thank you. Ambar. Hello, Ambar. Who were your partners, my dear? My partner was Susana. Tell me about Susana, please. Uh, if she could have lunch with anyone in the world, who would she choose? She told me she chose her mom because okay. she loves her and she she would like to spend time with her mom and she she told me her mom her mom enjoyed this moment uh, how do you say entre ellas uh this okay this moment for themselves this moment for themselves. Okay, cool. Excellent. Thank you very much, Amber. Thank you, teacher. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. Who, who, Roxana, who were your partners? My partners was, were, um, where? were Ana Belinda and Nuria. Okay, tell me about uh, Nuria. If she could have lunch with anyone in the world, who would she choose? She chose uh, Nelson Mandela because okay. uh, she thinks that he is an interesting, interesting person and he had a different mind and something like that. She, uh, she thinks that he's um, interesting. Okay, perfect. What about your other partner? Tell me. Well, Ana Belinda, you know, she always is she talking about Yanira. No, 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 Yanira. Oh. Oh, she Yanira thinks in Yanira. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> she always shows uh, Yanira and the rest of, the, of uh, her friends. But, you know, Yanira is the top. Yeah, I know, I know. She loves uh, talking about uh, everything or nothing, and that's it. And she says she cooks. Cool. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you very much, Roxana. Okay. And let's see. I still got one more. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Hmm. Who is it going to be? Rebecca. Hello, Rebecca. Hello, hello, teacher. <laughs> Tell me, Rebecca, uh, if you could, if you could have lunch with anyone in the world, who would you choose, and why? Okay, you asked me that question, <laughs> but uh, if I have that opportunity, I would like to have that lunch dinner with my favorite band. Its name is Il Bol. They are from Italy and this answer is connected with the other question because I also would like to travel to Italy if the money wasn't a problem. I really I really dream with with that travel. Go to Italy and meet my favorite band my favorite band. Uh, go to the different places from there and like that, just that. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Hey guys, very well done. Excellent, excellent work. Now let me get the attendance a second time, please. Uh, Amber Eli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Ana Claudia Gonzalez Velasquez. Present teacher. Daniel Eduardo Sagrada Valencia. Present teacher. Erwin Francisco Lopez Rojas. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin Gonzalez Martinez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. 
present teacher. Jose Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Marta Anabelinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atirio Méndez Granados. Nuria Elizabeth López Perlera. I'm here. Rebeca Jasmine Montarrosa Figueroa. Present. Roxana Ibeta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Stephanie Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present, teacher. Wilman Frank Figueroa Peñate. Present. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present, teacher. Shanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present. Marcela Noemí Batres Montarrosa. Present, teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present, teacher. Okay, thank you. Now, thank you, Nicolás. Next activity. Again, questions. Just that now it's a different type of question. Which person in your life has motivated you the most? Who do you admire the most? Okay. There's always somebody who's like a very important or perhaps in a, in a bad spot of our lives. We needed some words of... Uh, somebody to really, really uh, cheer us up. And that's what we are going to talk about right now. Which person in your life has motivated you the most? And who do you admire the most? Okay. So uh, you will have, again, five minutes. We will try to speed it up this time because in the previous one, it was like quite fast. And we are going to switch partners, okay? So you're working with somebody else right now. Please jump in. Hello. So Roxana, I never found out who, were, who did you want to have lunch with? Sorry? I never found out who would you like to have lunch with. Well, in my case, I just, Jesus Adrian Romero, do you know who is him? Who? Jesus Adrian Romero. Singer. Yeah. Gospel. Yeah. Gospel. Christian, uh-huh, yeah. Yeah, gospel. That's called mm -hmm. gospel music. Uh, my case also a singer, but not that type of music. Well, in my case, it's my favorite uh, singer since, I don't know, maybe I I was 34, I know, uh, 40, sorry. 40? 40, 14 years old, sorry. Oh. Desde que yo tenía 14 años, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. He, he's the one who sings the, 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 the sounds of silence. The sounds? Of silence. I don't know. Is he? Hmm. I will find out. In my case, I was thinking about uh, Diana Navarro. Love that singer. It's gospel? No. No, no. No. Says, no, no, she's actually a Spanish lady who sings uh, very good music, very, very good one. Diana Navarro, okay. Uh, Diana Navarro. Look for this one. Let's see. you like it, but I'll leave you to work. Which person in your life has motivated you the most? Who do you admire the most? Maria Alejandra says me. Yeah, well, yeah. 
No, teacher. <laughs> Como María Elena, no. I am motivating you every single day to learn more English and to practice. <laughs> I'll leave you to it, guys. Continue. Could you repeat? <clears throat> I can hear you. Oh, excuse me. Yeah. So, that was the question. Can you listen to me now? Better? Yes. Uh, yes, I, I listen. I For me, it's very it's, it's difficult to understand. Uh, Which? Uh, yes, understand for uh, understand the questions. Uh, okay. uh, I always, I always, uh, uh, how do you? So what, what, what's a different, what's a different situation from my brother, but he's a person. <laughs> Yes, and you got the, you got, I looked for the word on the translator and it says a scholarship. A scholarship, so, oh, okay. Is that the word I that got, you look for? Uh-huh. Yes. So okay. I got, okay. You got and the other person here is Marta Morales is with us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what about you, Marta? Yeah, yeah. Well, in my case, I. Me, you, of out. course. No, Marta. It no, was me. teacher, come on. <laughs> teacher. <laughs> Angel, the face is not really. <laughs> well, in my case. She has. In this world. She has in the sky. <laughs> okay. But he continue with you. Uh, uh, my mother is my angel. <laughs> yeah. So you continue with you, uh, carrying on. Since like 18 years ago, but okay. my father mm -hmm, always motivated me to uh, make the theme things I was afraid to do. For example, eh, always, I was afraid, I always said, no, I'm not going to sell anything. I'm not a, not a salesperson. I okay. didn't born to be for that eh, eh, yeah. career. And now, Anna, and now yeah. Anna Claudia could sell ice <laughs> everything. You know, teacher, he always <laughs> told able, me. She's so mm -hmm. able to sell ice to the schemos right now. <laughs> Okay. No, Good you know, he, he always, uh, every day he, he told me, you know, you are afraid <laughs> to do, but what you were born to, ay, como se, tenés miedo de hacer para lo que naciste. Okay. Uh, I don't know. You're you afraid were, of doing you're afraid? what you were born to. Ah, okay. You're afraid doing, of doing what you, what uh -huh. you were born what to. you sure. were born to. Okay. And that was his everyday saying, believe me. And I said, no, no, I don't believe that. After he died, uh, I okay. uh, there was an opportunity for me to uh, start in a new job. And that was a sales job. And okay. believe it or not, was my first experience. <laughs> and thanks God, uh, I was also a, a supervisor of sales in that place. I didn't know how, how come... Uh, this uh, how this happens but uh, <laughs> yes my dad was right uh, yeah. most of the time you are afraid to do what you were born to yes. yeah. <laughs> okay and that is yes, a... selling selling is not for me ah oh, it's so God. beautiful teacher <laughs> maybe you are afraid to do what you were born to <laughs> uh, when you never there was there was a time in my life when i uh -huh. worked as a seller, and believe me, uh, not my thing. It depends on the product, maybe. My first experience was with graves and funeral homes. Just imagine a, a difficult product. But I learned a lot. And since I was working, and since I had that experience, believe me, I really appreciate every day 
and I thank God for every day in my life. Yeah, it's good. It's good. I mean, it's good, good to enjoy what you do. Mm -hmm. and, and that is uh, the reason why my father is the person. Oops. Hey Fernando, how are you? Busy, I imagine. Hi teacher. Um, I I was in a call. In a oh, call of a work for. So I left the 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 group. I left the group. Okay, children. how was your day, my friend? Busy? Uh, yeah, usually. Usually there. Oh, you, are, the, you already started the, working on the closing, right? Right, right. Today was a, a, a normal day of the last week of the month. So hectic, <laughs> hectic, yeah. terrible day. Hey, hey, sorry, hated. Hectic. Uh, it's like this. What does it mean? Ooh, when you use that this word, uh, what we are saying is frenético. Uh, like, like, uh, like crazy. Frenético. Oh, Loco, okay. Febril, crazy. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this day are. The, the most of the the day of the last week of the month are happy. Yeah, that's normal. That's normal. I mean, for me, this week has been like that. Hectic. Yeah. <laughs> so many activities and ugh, rushing from place to place. But, you know, it's part of the game. Yeah, it's part of the game. It's the fun. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, guys. Well, I was checking out some groups. Thank you, Fernando. I was checking out some groups, and you were doing a very good exercise. And I'm glad to see that you were speaking in English. And for some, it was easier than for some others, but it's cool. I mean, they, that's the idea for you to practice. Now, let's see. Uh, we need to check a little bit of something here in the in the manual just give me a second because i had it prepared okay it's like right here okay guys let's see mm -hmm. and here we go Okay, look, according to my plan today, we're going to work with this and we're checking out the vocabulary. Now we got distribution channels for consumers products, direct channel, retail channel, and wholesale channel. In the direct channel, you got a producer and their relation is directly with the consumer. In the retail channel, you got the producer, the retailer, and then consumer. In the wholesale channel, you got the producer, the wholesale or distributor, and then the retailer, and finally the consumer. Now, why are we seeing this? Because the exercise six is the one that we are more interested in. In exercise six, you need to categorize the examples according to the channels presented in the chart. Check answers with a partner. So here you got examples, situations, and you need to see which you need to, to decide, okay, into which category each example fits. I mean, if Amazon sells Kindles to its customers through its own platform, tell me, is that direct channel, retail channel, or wholesale channel, okay? That's the activity you gonna do so what i'm gonna do right now i'm sending you the picture of the whole thing so you can like 
have it there. I'm going to send you back to working in groups. You will have eight minutes for this activity starting, let's see. Yeah, I just send you the picture. You will have eight minutes, but uh, yeah, you're gonna keep on working in groups of three members and let's do it. If there's any question, please give me a holler. Hmm. <laughs> Ikea. Yeah, Ikea. Yeah, Ikea. Ikea. Love it. Hey, that's a store, right? Okay. Yeah. We are talking about number two. Wholesale. Wholesale. Really? Yeah. But Ikea buys products from store. different. Yeah. But see, look. Cheap, oh, uh, yes. IKEA buys products from different manufacturers and sells them in their stores. So in order to oh, get to the consumer, fun. IKEA is what, the retailer? Not really. No. I mean, no. They are a wholesale or a distributor. Or sometimes, I mean, IKEA buys from different people. So Ikea, they buy from wholesale or distributors. Sell to sell. They are, Ikea is the retailer, but they buy from wholesale or distributors, not directly from the producer. 
Okay, but I, I don't understand who is the retail or who says teacher. What is the difference for IKEA? Yeah, look, it's like in number three. How some grocers supply a line of independent grocery store with uh, purchases in bulk. That's retail. Why? Because awesome grocers, they are the producer. And they send directly to the retailer. In, in bulk. Yes. Do you remember from yesterday that we were talking about who was a retailer? Yeah. Yes. A person or business that sells goods to the public in a small quantities for use. Um, small okay. quantity is bulk. Hmm? No. Small, small quantity for use is bulk. Granate. Small quantities. Okay. Uh, how do we explain this? Do you remember the activity from yesterday? Yesterday we were saying that. Hold on. Yeah. hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's do something here. Okay, do you remember this? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so in this case, a person of business that sells goods to the public in small quantities for use, that's a retailer, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, distributor, which is this, an agent who supplies goods to store and other business that sell to consumers, right? Yeah. So remember, we have here the retail, the person or business that sells goods to the public in a small quantities for use. Okay. Then we have like a uh, wholesale. Do you remember what is the wholesale? Is an intermediary entity mm -hmm. in the distribution channel that buys in bulk and sells to resellers. Mm -hmm. So here, like GAP, GAP is, a, is an example of wholesale. Wholesale? Because... Yeah, because GAP buys clothes from other manufacturers to mm -hmm. sell in their stores. Intermediary. Okay. Why? Because if you remember, what are they? An intermediary entity. Mm -hmm. Okay. A little bit complex, right? Yeah. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Hello, Erwin. What you got for me? What's the order you got? Sorry? What's the order you got? What is number one for you? Um, well, we have some problems trying to decide what's the best option. Uh, I said that the number one is retail, but Fernando think uh, this is direct, the number one. So- Actually it's direct. Okay. And the number two, I sell a uh, wholesale and- Which is correct. Uh, Fernando said that is a retail <laughs> because- Okay, now, are, number two are is wholesale. Really 
Number two is wholesale. And number okay. three, two is wholesale. Number three is retail. Yeah. Okay, I, I'm okay. I'm right. <laughs> okay. And number Ikea, four. Is... Ikea, Ikea is a retailer. Yeah. And number four? Uh, direct. Number four, direct. Direct. Yes. Perfect. Number five. Uh, we are thinking about it. Uh, we don't have number five. So, yep. Gap is a, a store as Siman, right? An uh, intermediary. Uh, huh? Gap is an intermediary. Is a, a Sara or something like that? No, it's like a, it's like a, like Siman. Okay. Gap is a brand. It's, it's a, brand. a brand, but but they have... uh, remember, remember, they buy clothes from other manufacturers to sell in their stores. They don't sell just theirs. They also okay. sell from other retailers, from other manufacturers. Sell. It's, so it's a retailer. It's a wholesale. No, it's a wholesale. It's a wholesale. Oh, okay. Yep. The last one. Better grocer Better. supplies a line of independent grocery stores with purchases in bulk. That's retail. Yeah. Full sale. Okay. That is wholesale. wholesale. Okay. okay, we got it. Okay, and yeah, because if is... you remember, if you remember from yesterday, a wholesaler, what is it? An intermediary entity in the distribution channel that buys in bulk and sells to resellers. Mm. Yeah, so I think it's a bit complex. Right? I think it, it, it's complex because the number five oh. done, done a specific that, yeah. They they sell in a small quantity or in a, or in a big yeah quantity. yeah yeah actually that's you're right you're right but let's finish this exercise so we can go to the conversation that is what everybody is really interested in right yeah okay yeah because tomorrow we are going to be working in well tomorrow we're gonna have conversation and a little bit of grammar. Okay. Hey, teacher. Yeah, tell me. Uh, how do you say in bulk in Spanish? Granel. A granel. Yeah. No es por mayor. No. Okay. Pero a granel no es por poquitos también. Uh, a granel, yes. But it's, I mean, you know, I have problems last time I was teaching this course exactly with this word. Okay. <laughs> because okay. actually when you say uh, a granel is la cantidad grande. Sorry, 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 sorry. I was talking. I'm sorry, guys. I just need to, to finish explaining something to her. Uh, when we say bulk, we are talking about uh, a group of goods, okay? But in big quantities. The difference is this, that is not, there's no packaging, okay? There's no packaging. There's no, no, uh, There's any type of packaging, there's, there's no branding. I mean, you just get the big quantity of product. That's what you talk when you when you say, when you use the term bulk. Am I clear? Yeah, I think so. Thank you very much. Okay. Well, guys, this activity was a little bit complex. I'll give you the answers, okay? Number one, direct channel. Number two, wholesale. Number three, retail. 
Number four, direct. Number five, false again. And number six, retail. Well, but today actually it's, uh, it's for us to have more conversations. Tomorrow we are going to work a little bit of grammar, okay? And we're going to be focused more on the, on the manual. Okay, let's see. Now, we got a different type of question, okay? And look at the questions we got. Well, the first one is not a question, actually. Name three things that make you happy. Think about it. Three things that make you happy, okay? Money. And, and then you say, and then you answer the question, what are your strengths, okay? So you are going to have, this is pretty short because you already are thinking about the three things that make you happy. So I'm sending you to groups and you will just have three minutes. So I need you to please, if you start speaking, don't take too long because your classmates need to express their opinion also there to share their information, okay? So just three minutes, hurry up. And what was the last one? The last one? Yes. What are your strengths? No, you said uh, travel, chocolate, and the last one I didn't hear. My pet. Oh, yes, yes. Now I got, I got it. In my case, um, what makes me happy maybe is feeling good. <laughs> um, my mom, and yes, could be travel, traveling. And uh, the other one, Walter. What about you? Okay, <clears throat> in my case, and and I happy. And playing soccer. Uh, I visit the beach. Y este, how do you say pasar? Pasar tiempo. Spend. Oh, excuse oh, me. Hobby. Hobby. Ah, okay. Hobby, my family. Oh, no, 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 no. In this case, is spend time with my family, Walter. Ah, okay. Spend time my family. Okay. Uh, maybe get out. Uh, travel. Travel. This is happy for me. Is be happy. Um, my strength. Travel. Uh, where? Into the country uh, or outside of the country? Or or. or <laughs> Maybe. I I really like visiting uh, all country for me. Uh, 
Hey, great. The name is our like to uh, to, I am a uh, very soy como kinestésico, o sea, es que necesito tocar las cosas. <laughs> you need to try it. Uh -huh. No, no, but try it, but make really? me happy when I stay with me. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. And maybe hi to when and I buy. <laughs> <laughs> and my pets. And the names are Buffy and Chipita. Buffy. Oh. Hey, bonita. Okay, guys, let's see. Well, I will ask now uh, the question to some of you, but meanwhile, I will also like you to think about this, uh, this little thing that I just texted to you. I need you to start thinking about three ways, well, at least one way to, to spice up your life because you need to share with your partners, okay? Think about three ways to, to spice up your life. When we say to spice up your life, hmm, spice up, uh, that expression literally it means uh, full. Uh, it's used for full, sazonat. That's to spice up, okay? But, when you say to spice up your life, that's to to exactly that. I mean to something that will make your life more interesting. Okay, that's exactly the the, the idea. Of, you could say darle sabor a tu vida. Okay, so that's what I want you to start thinking about. Ways, tell me something that you think will spice up your life. But before we get into that, let's see. Roxana, tell me three things that make you happy. Family, food, and hanging out with my friends. <laughs> okay, cool, cool, nice. Let's see, let's see. Mr. Osorio, tell me three things that make you happy. Uh, well, teacher, my my daughters, uh, the food that I like, and rest. Okay, perfect. Rebecca, mm -hmm. your turn. Well, sleep, watch series, and spend the time with my mother. Okay, perfect. Frank, tell me three things that make you happy. Uh, thinking quickly, I said my family, uh, do some workout, do workouts, I mean working out, and uh, great, uh, eat delicious food. Okay, yeah. perfect, thank you. Thank you. Walter, your turn. Tell me three things that make you happy. And always I had a smile. Okay.
I guess we're having problems with your connection. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Stephanie, what about you? Tell me three things that make you happy. <laughs> Sleep, eat, and spend time with my family and love. <laughs> okay, perfect. Uh, Wilfredo Guardado, tell me, what about you? Um, go out to play soccer with my children and okay. play in the same team and do exercise at home with them and go shopping with them. Okay, cool. Nice. Janita, what about you? Well, uh, spend time with my family, play with my pets, and try it, of course. Okay, cool. Maria Alejandra, your turn. Okay. <laughs> my pet, new shoes, and have a time for me. Uh -huh. Okay, well, we thought Roxana was the, the shoe lover, but we find out that Maria Alejandra also. Thank you, Maria Alejandra. Let's see, now, 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 whose turn is it? And let's see. Nicolas, three things that make you happy, please. Well, go to the beach. Do you read a good book and work in the mountain? Okay, go to the beach. Nice. Read a good book and work in the mountains. That's nice. Excellent, excellent. Now let's see. Fernando, tell me, please, what are your strengths? My strength. Um, tell me two, my, at least. My punctually. Okay. and my commitment with my job. Excellent, thank you. Erwin, what about you? What are your strengths? Well, I think maybe dedication, um, honesty, um, uh, creativity, discipline, Okay, and maybe okay, patience. Perfect. Okay, that's nice. That's a good one. Ambar, your turn. Tell me, what are your strengths? Well, I'm, in my case, my res uh, responsibility in my job and my honesty. And, well, I don't know. Uh, maybe my voice. <laughs> Okay, perfect. Thank you. Great. Thank you. Susana, tell me, name three things that make you happy. Uh, go to the beach, uh, play with my dog, and, and stay, stay with my family. Perfect. Ana Claudia, your turn. Three things that make you happy, please. To sleep, to travel, <laughs> yes, and to have a good time with family and friends. Mm -hmm. Cool, excellent, excellent. Mm -hmm. that's, that's great. Okay, mm -hmm. guys, now I'll send you to the groups again. Think up three ways to spice up your life and share them with your partner. Okay, I gave you time for you to think, and now you go and share with your partner. But you're going to be working in... Uh, well, some of you are going to be working in larger group, okay? So please jump in. Three minutes, three minutes. This is gonna go fast. Sorry, teacher, I got disconnected. I don't know which group I am. You are in group number five. But I just... Get in. No, because my uh, internet is unstable. And so 
I was out when the pop-up came up and now I'm connecting again. I don't know if you can add me to that. I'll send you first to room six and then I'll switch you to room five. Let's see. Okay. Yeah. Me. Sorry. No, no, no. You didn't want to work with her. You told me. <laughs> no. Let's, yeah. let's be honest. Let's because be honest. I stay alone and I think that. <laughs> no, sorry, Maria Alejandra. Here we let's are. Let's be honest. She was the teacher me, put Maria me Alejandra, off. <laughs> oh, no. These kids, she was telling me, oh, my God. Sorry, <laughs> oh, Claudia, but you don't have an option. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Come on. Okay, three. In another country. Try to, yes, live in another country. Try to establish my life, establish my life in another country. Uh, get, get, get a job in another country. And the second one is, is similar as you, is try to know New people, new people, different people, yes. Because same as you, I am very shy. Very shy, yeah, I'm very yeah. shy. So it's a, a little bit hard for me to no meet uh, or know new people. Okay. And the Perfect. third one, the third one may be a try to to do uh, different things that I think that I, that I can do. Oh. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like something try new or something, something new. that you, you don't usually new. could do. Yes, new sports or uh, try to, to do different business, your own business, right? And yeah. try to have a different experience uh, talking about about jobs, right? Okay. So okay. that's my answer. What about you, Fernando? Um, in my Bill? case, uh, the first one may be try to get the enough money to provide my family. Okay. And I always look in looking for other ways to, to provide the better conditions. Yes. <clears throat> then the second maybe my, my uh, desire, it could be of improve my knowledge about my job, about uh, other topics. And the third one, Maybe the my my spend time with my family, but not only my 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 family at home. As <clears throat> I I mean my my entire family. Mm -hmm. for, for example, my my family's parties are a good way to share with them and enjoy together. And my family have a uh, habit to celebrate uh, yeah. to celebrate birthdays uh, one time in a month. Okay. Oh, all, okay. The, <laughs> all the all the birthdays persons <laughs> in the month in a, in the in the only in a in a party in a one party. Okay. It's, it's a tradition. Yeah, it's a tradition, and it's a good. And, and it's it's a good way to share with them and yes, I don't know uh, fortalecer. How do you say fortalecer los lazos, teacher? Strength the bonds. Sorry. Strength the bonds. 
Strange the bones. Strange the bones. Okay. Strange the bones. All right. Maybe I, I, I find another one for me, and and try uh, new food. You know, I don't like to eat um something weird. I don't like seafood, Chinese okay. food. I know the Chinese. Chinese. <laughs> Chinese food, because when someone says, "Oh, can we eat um Chinese food, seafood?" I say, "No, I'm sorry, I don't like it." But so why you don't like Chinese? No, I don't like <laughs> like oh, I don't know how to say like weird food. Like I think it's weird. I don't know <laughs> with but different weird. taste. Yes, I don't know how to say um like like it's not usually that I eat. Well, well everybody's different. Like yeah. Fernando knows, so... Fernando knows I don't like pupusas. I mean, yeah. Oh really? I don't know. Yes. No. <laughs> I but what will joke. you do? <laughs> what will you do in, in Japan, Stephanie? <laughs> I don't with the, know. With the food. <laughs> that, but that's the reason why we are talking about something is spicy in our okay. life. Yeah, <laughs> well, yeah, yeah. well, you know, in Japan, there's a lot of delicious food. Yeah, I, I imagine. I can't remember yeah. what's the name so, of those little boxes. Maybe that the, will be like, something so that I will try. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sashimi. You can buy the little boxes. There's rice, there's little fish, there's little stuff, man. That's delicious. But I think that I can try Chinese food, but seafood, mm, I don't like a lot of seafood. <laughs> it's That's delicious. <laughs> yeah, it is. Let's go back to the main room, guys. Okay, let's see, let's see. Um, Jose Wilfredo, tell me, tell me one thing that, something that you think will spice up your life. Uh, I'm sorry, teacher, I have a problem with my audio. Can you repeat it, please? Tell me one thing something one way that uh you could spice up your life okay maybe hang it up with my family that's motivation for you that's cool yeah Excellent. because i love uh share a quality time with them okay great thank you you're welcome let's see what about you, Rebecca? Well, I think one thing that make me really happy and spice up my life is have the opportunity to play with my dogs. I have two dogs and all the time when I, before I, I excuse me, after I play with them, my life reset. And I can go to my job and start again. <laughs> okay, perfect. Thank you. What about you, Arwin? 
Um, well, one thing maybe I spend quality time with my I spend quality time apart with my family, maybe with my wife uh, and when my kids. Okay, thank you. And let's see, let's see, Ambar, what about you? Spend time with my family or my friends. Uh, eat ceviche and chocolate. Okay, cool. <laughs> okay. Now, guys, homework. Well, you know that you got the, the activities from the man, from the, from the, 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 the the course, right? The ones that you need to be performing. But besides that, I need you to please bring the answer to these two questions for tomorrow because you are going to start the class telling what is the funniest thing you have ever seen. Okay? And you're going to explain the situation. Usually, funny things are situations, right? So I will ask you to please explain me when was it, how was it, okay? So let me also share them with you in the group so you don't need to, to, to copy them. Copy them down. Okay, give me just a second, guys. Okay, there you go. Got them in the group. So for tomorrow, we are going to start our conversations, the class with that. That's gonna be our warm up, okay? So think about it, bring your questions, prepare your answers because remember you are going to explain to the class. I will pick like five or 10 of you so you can explain. Now, uh, let me get the attendance, please. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Thank you. Ana Claudia Gonzalez Velasquez. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Perfect. Erwin Francisco Lopez Rojas. Present. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. José Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present teacher. Nuria Elizabeth Lopez Perlera. I'm here, teacher. Rebeca Yasmin Montarrosa Figueroa. Present. Thank you. Roxana Iveda Sensio de Mejía. Present. Stephanie Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Billman Frank Figueroa Peñato. Present. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. Shanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Marcela Noemí Batres Monterrosa. Thank you, Janina. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Okay, thank you very much, guys. It was a pleasure for me to have you here. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Rest. Good night. Good evening. Good night. Good night, everybody. See you tomorrow. Good Bye, night. Guys. Take care.
Miss Gonzalez. Hey. Hello, hello. Hello, how today? are you? Hey, I'm just doing... fine, just fine. Hello. <laughs> I think you're having problems with the connection, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, because I don't quite hear you. Can you hear me? Oops. So it's Hi, teacher. Uh, Sorry, uh, but the uh, internet is unstable. Yeah. And I, I was telling you, teacher, I'm about to this. Sorry, teacher. Sorry. So, how's everything? Tell me. Uh, well, uh, it's, I'm doing very well just because I'm having a different time with uh, sharing with my family here because we're taking care of my mom because she underwear surgery that, that is right yeah. <laughs> that is the way right she underwear is not underwent. she under she underwent to a surgery or just she underwent no. surgery she underwent surgery surgery okay so we are i'm mostly taking care of her in this post surgery time is she is now uh, able to walk and go to the bathroom, for example, but there are still some different things I must do for her, like preparing her food or assisting her for... ¿Cómo se dice? Yo la estoy, yo la estoy curando, me estoy colocando vendas. ¿Cómo sería ese proceso? Yeah, I am... Okay. The thing is this, that uh, the word for curar, it's mm -hmm. heal. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. I'm, so I'm taking care. No, I'm yeah, taking, taking care. care. Uh -huh. uh, I'm taking care of her Perhaps. heels. De su herida, no. o como, como sería? I am treating. I am treating. Pero yo no soy una doctor ni una nursery se puede usar. No, but you are you are doing the process, right? Yes. Uh -huh. Cleaning the. So, mm -hmm. so you are treating her uh -huh. according to the doctor's instruction, right? Oh, got it. So okay, I'm treating her according to exactly to the doctor's That's instruction. That's the idea, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, exactly. Yes, because uh, I'm uh, doing poniendo vendas y todo eso. Yeah, complex. Mm -hmm. But also, uh, as I'm not working these days, I let's say I recovered the energy because Saturday was so hard. I, I didn't sleep. I didn't sleep at all because every 30 seconds or 15 minutes, there, there was a nurse going into the room, verifying everything was right. Then at the next half an hour, there was another doctor the doctor that was in I el doctor de guardia sería correcto decir el doctor de guardia eh, no el doctor no el doctor que estaba de turno <laughs> ah, the doctor in charge the doctor in charge okay and they were taking care for every certain time about the Ay, ¿cómo se dice las inyecciones? Ya se me olvidó. The charts. medicines, charts, ajá. ¿El suero? ¿Dónde el suero? ¿Cómo serum. Se llama? serum. Ah, ok, serum, igual que se usa para el pelo, serum, ese nombre. Yeah. Ah, ok. And so, it, it was, 
a little complicated, but I guess now I've recovered the energy I lost during the weekend. Uh -huh. ah, apart of that, my days are going very well. Okay, cool. Look, mm -hmm. uh, well, how do you like the class? The task we have for tomorrow? No, the class, the class. The oh, class. I'm sorry. You know, it's the inter <laughs> I feel uh, I feel it great because we talk a lot. Remember, I always the, the last time you asked me for that, I like this way of uh, teaching, and because you focus in the adult, adult adult learning process, which is totally different. And once you understand that, it's good because I'm always learning, teacher, and I like to talk a lot. Because sometimes if we focus just in the manual, it's not the same as repeating and same thing, but we need to apply a vocabulary to our regular days. You know, one thing I experienced and I want to share with you from the last course uh, to in the last two months is that I was able to close more cells in English. I was so surprised with me too. Because sometimes I yeah, cool. use, yes, yes, because you are talking with owners, with company owners in English, and you have to have a good communication skill. So I was trying to talk both with them and using the appropriate word. I was also surprised. And believe it or not, this month also, before I took these days off, I reached my 150% goal. Mm -hmm. And that makes me feel in, uh, good in peace because I know that even the month is uh, almost ending, I already made my job. Mm -hmm. But because I improved and I was able to do more sales in English. Mm -hmm. That's great, that's great. Mm -hmm. yeah. Excellent. That's good to hear. Now, yeah. look, uh, I got like a small project with you. I need you to. Uh, well, uh -huh. I need you. Well, I am doing this with some of you guys. I need you to set a goal uh -huh. for this module. Set for this goal. module, I need you to set a goal. What do you want to? What do you want for the end of this level? Is there a perhaps a topic or? a grammar point that you would like to, to have like good command of. That way I can start looking for info or perhaps ways to help you during the classes. Always the, uh, have a little difficulty always is with the, do you hear me teacher? Teacher, do yeah, you hear me? Ah, okay. It's with the use of the, uh, I, what is the name of this? Models? Time sentence. No, it, no, no. It's when we use the have, had, uh, I, no, it's, it's infinite, no. Present perfect, no. And past perfect, I guess. Oh, okay. Perfect tenses. Yeah. Perfect tenses in, in the past and in the future. That is always ah, like a kind of mm -hmm, topic that. Yeah. Okay. When to use has. I uh -huh. take you it have... into an account and I mm -hmm. will start like uh, in your case what I have noticed that really works for you is mm -hmm. putting them into practice okay mm -hmm. so I will not like start giving you a lot of grammar explanation but I will start giving you examples during the class okay ah okay awesome yes because I'm always confused if when I use in present Always, I must use the verbs in 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 past participle. In past participle, uh -huh. All of them, I, or when I use the past way using had, also I must use the past participle. That is the confusion that I have. Don't worry, that. don't worry. Mm -hmm. I'll take it into an account. Actually, I got. I am writing. Uh, the, also, I'm taking notes. <laughs> I'm taking notes of 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 the people that I am. Giving that uh, 
those ideas so we can uh -huh. start like working and including them into the class and they could awesome. benefit the rest of the class also yes yes because there are so they are topics that they are like moving in the air <laughs> yeah sure mm -hmm. okay that's great hola Ana claudia it was a pleasure for me I always for me it's a pleasure talking to you teacher and thank you very much believe me uh, the, oh, the way you. how we how you make us to uh, improve our conversation even though I work in a call center you just don't imagine how much I learn every day and what I I saw my improvement selling and also my bosses because I have they are three bosses I have one direct but there are other tools that they were oh she's selling more in English uh, to the customers and that's great because most of the, the, the my my team co-workers we are comfortable just selling in Spanish and yes we do have meetings and webinars and trainings in English but when you sell in English it's totally different it's yeah. uh, mm -hmm. yes, it right is. exactly so I'm happy for that <laughs> thank you very much okay. teacher have a good night the same to you, teacher. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.